Geodetic engineering deals with the collection and measurement of spatial data above, on, or below the surface of the Earth using appropriate technologies, and the scientific and methodological processing and management of these data for the production of spatial information systems, maps, plans, charts, and other documents. Among its major fields are surveying, geodesy, global navigation satellite system, remote sensing, photogrammetry, geographic information system, and cartography. On June 1996, the Northern Mindanao State Institute of Science and Technology, now the Caraga State University, offered the Associate in Geodetic Engineering or AGE program. After five years, a bachelor's degree in geodetic engineering was finally offered. The program has then continuously advanced from traditional to the modern practice of geodetic engineering. Aimed at meeting the needs of the GE industry for new skills brought about by the advancements in surveying and mapping technologies, particularly GNSS, RS, GIS, light detection and ranging, building information modeling, and unmanned aerial systems, among others, the BSGE program has undergone several reviews and assessments, particularly on its curriculum. Several activities have been conducted to ensure quality in the process of developing the BSGE curriculum. The curriculum review, assessment, revision, and updating of the program has been conducted five times in a span of 17 years. Presently, the program is implementing the four-year 2018 BSGE curriculum designed to develop geodetic engineers who have a background in mathematics, physical engineering, and allied sciences. The BSGE program is anchored to enable the graduates to apply the different knowledge gained from the course, work effectively in diverse fields of practice, understand the societal and environmental impacts of the geodetic engineering, among other outcomes. The program also has well-defined educational objectives which are directed to advance the practice of the BSGE students to be globally competitive, upholding the CSU mission values, and responsive to the holistic demand for a geodetic engineer in protecting the environment, human life, and property, promoting the socio-economic development, and in providing innovative systems for good governance and community service. The college's competent faculty and staff, complemented by its wide range of modern equipment and facilities, have enabled its students to attain core GE competencies necessary for the global practice of the profession, such as the collection of spatial data using various techniques, quality assurance of outputs, and conduct of research and development activities in any of the major fields of GE, and development of business entrepreneurship skills. To ensure the delivery of quality education, the CSU BSGE program provides state-of-the-art equipment, laboratories, research centers, and other facilities to supplement the learning process of the students. Utilizing these, the learning outcomes and potentials of the students are being maximized. During enrollment, the program has carefully accepted freshman students who have high scores in the entrance exam and exuded good performances in their high school mathematics and natural science subjects. Incoming students are assessed through an interview to ensure the quality of BSGE enrollees. Since its establishment, the population of students taking up BSGE in CSU has significantly increased year after year, making it one of the most sought-after courses in the university. I choose BSGE because it is one of the most standard programs in CSU. This program brings students to various fields like cartography, photogrammetry, hydrography, construction, and mine survey. Here I am pursuing genetic engineering because I was convinced 
of the course highly demand offering plus high salary pay. I've learned that this program can contribute deeply in aiding the environmental problems we are facing right now and for the future. When I transferred from MSU, I only knew the best engineering course in CSU, and that is BSGE. Even before that, I already knew that CSU produces top notchers in the GE board exam, and it inspires me to be one of them. It is the school that produces globally competitive individuals that motivates me to take up this course. One of the factors also included the competent lineup of the faculty members in this program. And lastly, it was practically a great choice for me because as far as I know, as long as there is land, I can serve my purpose. I then realized that I am on the right track, especially that I am one of the students here in Caraga State University. It is one of the best programs that CSU offers. The BSGE program considers instructional strategies as very crucial in providing for individual student needs and the development of their multiple intelligences. Classroom instruction in CSU, especially in the BSGE program, is enriched through the use of various strategies such as peer teaching or cooperative learning, computer-assisted instruction, symposia, seminars, workshops and professional lectures, educational tours and learning visits, among many others. In addition to a comprehensive syllabus and available textbooks and reference materials, the development of the instructional materials and its use in the delivery of instruction are a requirement for all faculty members. Knowledge and skills learned from the different subjects are demonstrated and further enhanced through an immersion in a real work setting. Students will be exposed through a 120-hour survey camp during the summer of their second year and a 240-hour on-the-job training on their fourth year. BSG students can have their OJT on government offices, private surveying companies, mining companies, and research institutions. The trainees are well monitored by the faculty members through actual visits in the area or phone conversation or through the use of social media. Trainees are evaluated by their employers for their work performance to identify aspects of improvement. Detailed reports are submitted by the students after their OJT. The application of theories and techniques are realized when they take their undergraduate thesis where they are required to defend and implement the proposals they prepared earlier with guidance by an assigned thesis advisor. Graduating students must undergo thesis as prescribed in the curriculum. CSU BSGE faculty and students are recipients of several awards. Faculty members are recognized institutionally for their excellence in teaching, while students bagged international awards in research, as well as other institutional distinctions in leadership, culture, and the arts. From 2014 to 2017, the BSGE program has produced a total of 114 graduates. The percentages of students who graduated on time were relatively low for 2014 to 2016. However, in 2017, a significant increase to 60% was achieved. Um, I'm very thankful that um, I belong to this university, to this family. I made the right decision in taking up a BSGE program in Caraga State University. The program does not only conveys to the students to um, master their profession, which is to conduct an actual field or activities, but also we are encouraged to attend national and international conferences. In fact, I won and received an award as one of the best poster presenters during the Asian Conference on Remote Sensing. Immediately after I graduated, I was hired as a GIS analyst. To this point, I am considering my career as a very much successful one. And I would like to thank the Caraga State University, all my instructors, the faculty of the BSG program. What I am now today is because of the Caraga State University. CSU taught me to be strong and resilient and 
It also helped me grow as a student and now as a professional. The CSU students is, is very talented in, with regards to the GIS, the Graph Information System, and other uh, modern technologies which I will promote you that you have to take geodetic engineering course in CSU Karaga, considering that CSU Karaga is competitive in terms of schools, considering that the top notch of last exam is coming from this CSU or this Karaga region sa Karaga State University. Yung mga graduates ng CSU na BSGE, napakagaling nila. I have five licensed geodetic engineer in my office, graduate from the CSU. And they are so very helpful in terms of the task assigned to them. Those graduates from the CSU, they are so, we can trust them in terms of uh, computer literacy. Instructor, the professor of the BSG, G, alam na alam na nila kung ano yung dapat na ituturo doon sa mga estudyante niya. CSU BSGE graduates have a very high employment rate of 99% based on a recent tracer study conducted by the university. Among all programs, BSGE graduates are receiving the highest monthly salary of more than 90,000 pesos. From 2007 to 2017, the program produced a total of 157 geodetic engineers. CSU BSGE graduates have also top-notched several licensure exams and were able to occupy all the top 10 spots from 2007 to 2017. Last 2017, a CSU BSGE graduate ranked number one on the licensure exam in the person of Engineer Janelle Vernante. Pupunihin ngayon ang Caragal State University Main Campus sa Butuan City matapos silang manguna sa 2017 Geodetic Engineering Board Examination. CSU and the BSG faculty helped me a lot to reach that dream. With the advancement of the technology, our profession has also advanced. Thus, our BSG faculty teach us relevant topics like remote sensing and sat satellite geodesy. Also, the in-house review, the encouragement and tips from the faculty, all of that played an important role to my achievement. The CSU BSG program conforms to the university's research and development agenda to aid in addressing the pressing needs of the region, particularly in environmental management and eco-governance, spatial information and geoinformatics, and ICT-enabled regional development. As to the contribution of the Geodetic Engineering Program to the leapfrogging of the Caraga State University in terms of issues leveling from issues in level 2 to level 4, the program has contributed in 2016 alone about 40 plus publications in Scopus Index journals and in proceedings, particularly in the ECRS and the ISPRS. The Geodetic Engineering Program, in partnership with the Center for Geoinformatics, has also conducted trainings, particularly in developing the capability of faculty members at the Caraga State University and also other higher education institutions in Caraga region, particularly in GIS mapping in relation to their research activities. The faculty and students of the program are actively involved in various research engagements and well-funded research projects such as the SAGO project, Responsible Mining, Phil LIDAR 1 and 2, and the GeoSafer Agusan project. SGA or Caraga Center for Geoinformatics is a interdisciplinary center for the conduct of research, training, and extension in the field of geoinformatics. So when you say geoinformatics, it, it includes remote sensing, uh, global navigation satellite systems, geodesy, and uh, geographic information system, and all technologies that are related to the acquisition, processing, and dissemination of geographic information. 
The, the major projects that the center have implemented in the past years na until now are actually inter externally funded projects. The SAGO uh, Project 2.2, which was funded by the USCP Shirt, uh, also called Spectral and Structural Characterization of SAGO Palm and its Habitat. The project is under the SAGO Bioresource Assessment for Sustainable Industry Utilization using Remote Sensing, Geospatial Analysis, and Suitability Relations. So the main goal of this project is actually to characterize Sago Palm and finding areas suitable for its mass propagation to drive and sustain a Sago starch industry in the Philippines. Uh, the next major project that was implemented by the center was called the CSU Lidar 1 project. It was a three-year project implemented from 2014 to 2017. The goal of the CSU Lidar 1 project is to generate detailed flood hazard maps of flood-prone river basins and watersheds in Caraga region using light detection and ranging uh, technology. After the CSU Filider 1 project, the center embarked on another major project called the GOC for Mindanao or Geoinformatics for the Systematic Assessment of Flood Effects and Risk Towards a Resilient Mindanao. The LiDAR 1 program already ended last uh, March of 2017. Pero, wala nag-end more about the sense of responsibility to really provide information to the local government units. Because there are local government units which is part of the river basin na wala pa sila na cover during the LiDAR 1 program. They said that we are also experiencing flooding. That's why they requested that their municipality will be included in the flood hazard mapping. So they sent their request and then we decided to propose a new program which is called GeoSafe for Mindanao. GeoSafe for Mindanao stands for Geoinformatics for a Systematic Assessment of Flood Effects and Risk Towards a Resilient Mindanao. It's a program composed of five projects implemented by five higher education institutions in Mindanao. This program is funded by the OSTP Shared for two years. We started June of 2017 and we will end by May of 2019. GeoSafe Reduction Project covers 14 sub-river basins of the Agusan River Basin. So that's from Agusan del Sur down to Butuan City. The tagline of the program is um, saving lives. To, to come up with the output, to come up with a flood hazard map that will be utilized by the local government, government units to save lives. Through its research activities, the program was able to establish a strong linkage with its stakeholders, such as the local government units across the region and other government and non-government agencies. Numerous research papers made through the projects are being published locally, nationally, and internationally in ISI and Scopus Index journals. Published research outputs by BSGE faculty researchers are well cited among online abstract and citation directories as they are being utilized both in the national and international arenas. Research outputs developed by the faculty and students of the program are also presented in local, national, and international conferences in the field of remote sensing, disaster risk reduction, environment, and ICT. The CSU BSGE department also takes pride in the various local, national, and international awards and recognition given to the research papers, outputs, as well as faculty and student researchers of the department for excellence in the conduct of its research initiatives over the years. Among the major goals of the university is to conduct relevant extension programs and participate in community activities that will promote awareness on socio-economic, legal, and environmental issues. With this, Several extension programs have been conducted by the department through its partners and with support from the Office of the Vice President for Research, Innovation, and Extension. The extension projects of the program are congruent with the goals and objectives of the college and that of the university. Students were actively involved during the conduct of extension projects. 
an extension project on flood hazard assessment and mapping and sago palm propagation for flood mitigation was conducted in Barangay Limon, Butuan City, through which residents were given seminar workshops and involved in participatory mapping. The program also conducted an extension project on near-real-time flood event visualization and damage estimations or the flood evidence for smarter disaster risk reduction in the municipality of Habonga. Because of its success, the Department of Science and Technology Caraga Region, through its Project Storm, collaborated with the BSGE researchers by providing technical assistance and applications for its beneficiary LGU. Ang Habonga po ay isa po siya sa mga munisipyo na nakapapalibot sa fourth largest lake of the Philippines, yung Kong Lake Mainit, dahil sa kanyang karakteristik na sa low-lying ano siya, location. So, nagkakaroon ng perennial flooding. Kasi talaga siyang may tutulong kasi maama po forecast na kung sino mga pamilya, ilang pamilya ba, ilang individual, ang maapektuhan kapag merong baha, lalo na yung flash flood area kasi meron din kami mga flash flood areas. Basically, malalaman na natin kasi meron siyang forecast in 6 hours hanggang saan level ba yung spilling level niya, kung saan siya aabot yung level ng tubig. Doon namin siya din mapaplano, magagamit siya for planning. We are very fortunate uh, to have a strong partnership with the genetic engineering program of Caraga State University because we are able to uh, effectively and have an impact uh, to the communities uh, when we implemented uh, our project uh, called STORM. I believe it is only the Caraga State University's genetic engineering program who are able to provide this kind of extension services. Because of this system, uh, the local government units, which are our beneficiary of OBSTORM, uh, are prepared when, when flood comes. The system is so good that uh, a lot of our counterpart in other regions are envious that they, we have the system while they don't have. It is possible because the genetic engineering uh, program was able to develop uh, this technology of course, through their highly qualified and uh, capable uh, faculties. BSGE extension projects are well monitored to ensure that all remarks and suggestions are being gathered. Forums and consultative meetings are conducted by the extension project implementers with the community and the collaborating agencies in which objective feedbacks are extracted from everyone involved in the projects for the improvement of the delivery of its extension services. Aside from its mandated tasks and responsibilities, the program widens its scope and activities by providing other forms of services to its partners and stakeholders. BSGE students, faculty, and administrative personnel are actively taking part in organizing program-related events and training. The Caraga Center for Geoinformatics has been accredited as a Continuing Professional Development Points Provider by the Professional Regulation Commission. The BSGE program, since its establishment, has indeed exemplified excellence in terms of instruction, research, and extension initiatives. Milestone after milestone, the program was able to uphold the core values of the university, competence, service, and uprightness. But the journey surely does not stop right here. With support from the administration and its stakeholders, the CSU BSGE program will continue raising the bar of success for the nation, for the world, and unto God. University, measuring the earth.